You're a superhero How's it going? Today I'm gonna to be reviewing the Clovis Cloner weapon. This is the trial for new weapon that just came out this week. Not many people have it because it was really hard to get it done. Actually it was time consuming, it wasn't hard. But I played a lot, I played really really much Respondables this week and I got this weapon. I actually like this weapon and you'll see why. So let's go in missions and test it out. Okay so as you can see I'm using glass cannon. So I'm gonna test it out first with glass cannon and after without. So with glass cannon, as you can see in missions, it's one shot, one kill to everyone. Also, you can see that active skill is shamrocks onto the ground, and they're like trap medals. Basically, the same thing as trap medals, but they look like shamrocks. So this makes this weapon a cool troll weapon, like puts shamrocks all over the map with the active skill instead of wasting trap medals, which is really, really fun. Now let's see the weapon without glass cannon. So without glass cannon, it's again one shot, one kill in missions, close range. But long range is not one shot one kill without glass cannon. Okay, so let's go with glass cannon in team versus and test it out. Okay, so I got ahead and joined the lobby in team versus. As you can see, this weapon is one shot at close ranges. At medium ranges, it's two shot. And at long ranges, it's like five shot or something. I don't know, it's really, really bad at long range, this weapon. And also the fire rate is kind of bad with this weapon. So yeah, for this weapon, I recommend you use zombie wool and glass cannon. If you don't have it also you cannot use it then, you cannot use glass cannon and you won't get double damage and this weapon won't be that good. But if you have glass cannon this weapon can be decent. Also without glass cannon actually you could get a few kills here and there with this weapon. By far it's not a broken weapon, it's a decent weapon to use. Okay so overall this weapon has really really good damage, decent fire rate but it's bad at long range and also the reload time is kind of bad. So I wouldn't rate this weapon as an OP weapon but I would rate it as a fun weapon to use. Also has a very cool active skill so you can use it to troll people. And basically this is hinting towards the next event which is gonna be the St. Patrick's that's coming out tomorrow. And I'm gonna live stream that too. I actually did well in this lobby with this weapon. And it's a fun weapon to use. But I wouldn't recommend it if you're child harding as I said before. So yeah, on that note, I'll see you guys tomorrow on my live stream of the new event. If it comes out tomorrow, which is probably gonna come out tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Peace.